This math knowledge practice test question for the ASVAB and PyCat says, find the value of the expression 5 times x plus 3 squared minus 3x if x equals 4. Again, on the actual ASVAB and PyCat, you're not given a reference sheet or a calculator. For that reason, I recommend you get in the habit of copying things down and working them out on your own scratch paper, since you'll be doing that on test day anyways. So the first thing we have to do in order to evaluate this expression is plug in four wherever we see x. So this becomes five times four plus three squared minus three times four. Now, in order to get this one correct, you also have to pay very close attention to the order of operations. Again, the order of operations tells you the order in which to evaluate something like this. And I remember the order of operations using the acronym PEMDAS or the uh, mnemonic device, please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. It says you work out what's in parentheses first, exponents next, multiplication and division as they appear in the expression from left to right, that is to say they're treated as equals, and then finally addition and subtraction as they appear in the expression from left to right. Once again, addition and subtraction are tr treated as equals. All right, so let's look through our expression. Do we have anything in parentheses? We do, we have four plus three. So we're gonna take care of that first. This becomes five times four plus three is seven squared minus three times four. All right, we took care of our parentheses. Do we have any exponents? We do, we have seven squared. Seven squared is the same thing as seven times seven, which is gonna be 49. So this becomes five times 49 minus three times four. Now, if we look at this expression, what do we have left? We have five times 49, which is uh, multiplication. We have subtraction here, and then we have three times four, which is multiplication. So we're gonna work out our multiplication as it appears in the expression from left to right. So in other words, I'm gonna do 49 times five. Now, nine times five is 45. So bring down a five, carry a four, four times uh, 5 is 20 plus 4 is 24. This becomes 245 minus 3 times 4. Again, what do we have left? We have subtraction and multiplication. You always do your multiplication before your subtraction, so let's take care of that. This becomes 245. 3 times 4 is 12, so this is 245 minus 12. Again, we only have one operation left, so let's go ahead and take care of that. 245 minus 12 is five minus two is three, four minus one is three, two minus nothing is two. So the result we get when we evaluate this expression when x equals four is gonna be D 233.